Greetings friends. Today we are going to learn how we can authorize our Django REST framework app using JWT or JSON Web Token. For this I will be using this blog from Study Gyan. So let's see how we can do this. The first thing that we need to do is install this REST framework and then go to this website to download a base app. For now, since I don't have any other window open, I will first download this base app. I need to download the master branch. We can also refer to the final branch in case we face any issues. So I will download the zip file and then open it in the file explorer. Now I'll just simply copy it and then paste it in a folder of my choosing. Now let's open the command prompt. The first thing that I'll be doing is creating a virtual environment for this web app. As soon as the web app is complete, I will log, I will open it using the following command. Now let's open the app. Before opening the server, we should also make sure to download all the dependencies for this web app. For this, I will simply use the requirement.txt file that was provided to us along with this app. And since I am using a virtual environment, all these dependencies won't affect the rest of my system either. As we can see that these dependencies were loaded quite quickly. So before going any further, let's see if this app is working. For this, I'll simply use the run server command and then open my browser. As I can see that this framework, that this Django app is working perfectly. Now let's see what the next step is. For this I'll go back to the blog and see. We have to change this REST framework aspect in the settings.py file. For this I will simply go to the Django REST, the main app and then open settings.py. Here I will look for it and I found it at the very bottom. So I'll quickly fix it and go see the next step. It says that I need to import these two libraries in the urls.py file of the main project. So I'll go to the urls.py and enter these import statements. I also need to add these two paths and with this I have successfully set up my JWT base project. But how do I use it? For this I will be using a special tool called Postman whose installation we have already learned in previous modules. For this we will be using a special tool called Postman whose installation and usage we have already seen. So I will just open a tab and then see what the and then see what I need to do. For usage, the first thing that I need to do is acquire the tokens. For this, I'll copy this URL and then go to Postman. I know that the port number of this application is 8000. So I will simply change this parameter. and then see the next step this framework this base app comes with the following default values for the username and password so i'll be using them but the first thing i will do is change the request from get to post 
and then and then I have to open the XWW form URL encoded to enter the following keys. And the password is simply password. With this, I think my app is good to go. So I will make this request Of course, I have entered the wrong port number, so I will make the request once more. Here I need to copy this access key and then see what the next, uh, next step is. Now it tells us to create a new tab in the postman and go to the following URL. This, re this request has to be made under the get and under authorization and bearer token I will enter the following token now let's make this request I again forgot to enter the port number as we can see that the request has been handled but but the postman didn't provide us with a response this is because we haven't added any to our database you can very well add new entries to the database to test this just make sure one thing that this access token is valid for a limited amount of time and if you want to make requests after that you need to renew it either sending the post request once again or using the re refresh token that will be all for today thank you